Yo, guys, I almost just died. What is up? Welcome back. Today, we're vlogging again. Um, I figured I would just show you guys what we've been up to since yesterday. Uh, show you a couple of future projects that are in the works or planned. Um, so yeah, let's just, just, just get to the progress I've made on our new uh, hangout spot here. Um, I had about two fires in here yesterday just to kind of build up the ashes a little bit. Um, I think I'm going to start a fire in here again now that all this stuff is probably pretty dry. Uh, just this stuff that I already, like, was in there. Um, <laughs> these desks here, they used to have little tables on them. But obviously, you know, for a 16-year-old or an adult, that wouldn't work. So I took an axe and I chopped them off. And as you can see, we've got a, a lonely table over there. That's rotten and poopy. Uh, yeah, I just kind of... Anything that thought out that I could rip up out of the ground. Because a lot of this stuff is actually stuck in the ground. Like, this is all that's been sitting here for, like, 20-plus years, probably. Like, like all these old desks. And I try pulling them out, and they're just stuck in the ground, as you can see. And, but I, I'm just going to keep trying every day until eventually I can rip them out. Same thing with these tires. There's a lot of tires back here, and I just can't get them out of the ground. Um, but, yeah. I have made a bit of progress. I've brought some chairs back here. And then obviously these, these are actually pretty okay. I've sat in them, uh, well, I've sat in this one and, and that one just to test them out to make sure they're actually safe for sitting. That one's fine. That's the one from our old spot and so is that one. Uh, but yeah, that's how this spot is going. Let's go And the truck, I mean, are back in their, in their designated spots. Now the truck isn't just, just chilling over there anymore. So we did that. Oh. This snow is really slippery right there, guys. I'm gonna be honest. I guess I could show you uh, my window situation for my room. It's a little strange. Okay, it's still pretty slippery back there. This. So, I've tried making sole repairs to this, but it just falls off, as you can see, because my window quite literally just fell out. Uh, so I'll probably just, this, well, that actually seems to be staying in, but we're going to take it out because it's actually starting to get kind of hot in my room now. So now we've just got just those parts that fell out of my window randomly. Uh, holy crap, that yeah, is really random back here. Super random back here. But I did want to go this way anyways, now that I think about it. Uh, all that old stuff. Don't really have any plans with that. But uh, don't mind the feces. Over here is the big, big attraction. The, the good old, good old truck that is stuck here. Because, well, I won't really go too in depth about it, but uh, it's stuck here now. And as soon as the snow melts, me and my dad, we're gonna use that other truck, and we're gonna get this thing out of here. Well, someone else is piloting this one. And just driving in. I got it so fucking deep. It's still, I keep slipping. But yeah, we're going to get another tire on there. And uh, that one's actually flat. So we're going to have to air that one up. And then we're going to get this thing out of here. It's a really nice truck. And it's a shame that it is sitting here. So we are going to take care of that. We've made the return. <coughs> it's like he knows. <laughs> it's just like he knows. They never stop. They never stop, do they? This is a work in progress. I managed to flip this thing up. If you saw the last video, this thing was completely tipped over and like sunk in the water. I flipped it up. It's now just sitting upright. And I tried to dig a little canal, not too deep to like ruin the, uh, obviously like ruin the ground, but deep enough to where at least some of this water would flow down. And now it's just kind of slowly, but surely flowing down to the point of basically this part melting and it's just kind of just slowly but surely floating in at our... Eh. <laughs> it works. It somewhat works. My dad actually plans to park that uh, car over there just right here in front of our, well, woodshed garage thing, the jig. And then, uh... We actually plan this thing over here 
I want to take uh, all this snow blowing crap and snow crap off of it and get this thing running. It's just, it's just a normal tractor, which I think would be pretty cool. Hey, bye Rocky. They like sit on top of the dog houses. I don't know why. Bear, how's it going, buddy? Just to just clarify, we don't leave them outside all day. We bring them back in at like six o'clock. So actually more like four or five o'clock. But it is nice to have them out of the house because they're super obnoxious. They really are quite the burden. Isn't that right, boys? Yeah, isn't that right, Rocky and Bear? Well, at least they're not being little babies. Good boys. I was recording. As soon as I stopped recording, they both looked at the camera, but I had already finished recording. Bastards. Absolute bastards. And there's this travesty. This thing is just bending in at the sides. It's not good. It's not what you want, man. It's not what you want, what you really, really want, what you really, really want. Yeah. Hey guys, this over here. Uh, he chucked glass bottles back here, so I started standing them up so that we, we can shoot them with our BB gun when we're bored. And then I'm gonna move this thing, because I, I moved this thing here before I started coming up with an idea. I kinda wanna, you know, with like this old swing set, you know, this old stuff here, I, I brought this old wheelbarrow and the old shovel here, just to kinda create a bit of an aesthetic for it. Just to kinda make it look kinda cool over here. But guys, I think that is, that's gonna be the end of this one. Um, Hope you all enjoyed, and I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.